All right, welcome back. Final objective for this week's Eternity of Pain is a hashtag Fantastic Four champion. So I'm going to go with Torch here. Again, similar things as before. Blocking an attack is going to put a disorient. Hitting into his block is going to put a bleed with minor damage, so willpower will help. Throwing specials or evading specials is going to give him burnout charges. When he gets to 10, he's going to get power locked. Clap back. So here, every incinerate that I'm putting on him is just feeding my smolders. So the, lo the more incinerates I put on him, the higher my smolder goes, the more incinerate uh, the more damage the incinerates are going to be doing throughout the fight. Again, uh, and then his special co his his uh, specials cost zero power when there is a debuff on you. So if he throws that special too, and I have a debuff on me, he'll stay at two bars of power and have to throw it again. Now, again, you can again take advantage of the fact that you all you want to do with Nick Fury is push him to special twos. You do not want to deal with the special one. You also, similar to Proxima, you got to be careful of his tactical charges. Like right now, he is unblockable. So I got to back off and evade the special two, and then I can go and attack back in. And if I push him over back uh, after 19 tactical charges, when he gets to like 20, it resets and the uh, unblockable goes away. Now, I do have a, uh, I want to throw, I like throwing special twos with Torch on this fight because then it's going to put a stun on him and it's going to ensure that I can A, get my temperature up to full and B, I can attack in and push him to a, uh, to two bars of power and just rinse and repeat this over and over again. I was doing really well because my uh, smolders were up. I was doing really well in the fight. I was got into a good rhythm. It might take a few tries before you get the rhythm going, but um, I had it going and then I got clipped by a um, uh, special one and that was the end of the fight. I did revive and finish up. So if you want to see the rest of it, feel free. But that was the uh, strategy in here. Again, similar to the other two, push the special two as much as possible. Even if you go ahead and like hit into his block and uh, put those bleeds on you, it's not going to kill you. It's just going to put minor, minor damage. But uh, if you have willpower healing, you'll be healing up the entire fight at the same time. So it helps you last you know, uh, sur like the survivability of the fight, it gives you some options there and gives you some options to try and keep him at special two as much as possible. You can see here he's got now he's power locked so I can hit into him as much as possible, whether he's at zero bars of power when he's power locked or if he's at two bars of power when he's power locked, it, that's fine. Just not at one bar of power. That is the, that is the hardest part of this fight. So I hope you enjoy the rest of them. That's all the objectives done for this week. I hope that helps and we'll see you in the next one, guys. Bye.